Well, the atmosphere has been building up all day long, and we're almost ready for kickoff here at Stamford Bridge. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And it's out with the old and in with the new. A brand new year, and looking forward to bringing you live action. It is Chelsea versus Everton. Well, I just hope the players haven't been partying too hard, as these games on New Year's Day can flatter to deceive. Hopefully that isn't the case here, and we get a really good game. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Kalidou Koulibaly plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And the striker today is Raheem Sterling. And here's the team for Everton. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. James Tarkovsky plays alongside Yeri Mina in central defence. Alex Iwobi starts alongside Abdoulaye Ducouré in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert-Lewin. It should be a match to look forward to. Chelsea get it underway. Wonderful chance. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Ducouré. Wasteful here from Everton. Well, it's understandable that we're focusing on Jorginho. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him in this match? Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Corner coming up. It's a short one. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Out of play it goes, and it will be a throw-in. N'Golo Conte. Mount. Nicely timed tackle. Calvert-Lewin. On to James. Well, a textbook interception. Calvert Lewin. Tremendous block. And Kai Havertz. Can they get themselves in front here? Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. This is a message for Owen Kennedy. Owen, happy birthday. And Golo Conte. Jonathan Fish. Mount. And return to Conte. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Yeri Mina. Mikolenko. Oh, a lovely ball. McNeil. He's got to clatter it away. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Jorginho. And Sterling has it. It did look on for them, but not to be. It will be. And now Dominic Carvert-Lewin. 
And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Calvert-Lewin. Ducouré. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work with. Oh, he squandered the chance, and he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway. He was offside, but nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Well, first things first, they need the ball again. And he takes on the shot. Got to it easily, the keeper. Conte. They look as though they want to make this move count. Mount. And return to Conte. Big chance. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, not cleared away completely. And I think the threat has been averted. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Well, Mason Mount, normally so competent and influential, but not so much on this occasion so far. Well, as the touch map shows us, he hasn't been getting into the right areas to cause damage. He's such a good player around the box, but not today. He's been disappointing. And the match underway here at Stamford Bridge. So the beginning of the second half here at Stamford Bridge. wilting under the pressure and now a majestic piece of goalkeeping well he loves the big moments doesn't he and he's proved it again there great goalkeeping but he's gone short with it I'm trying to build ahead of steam another corner it'll be Let's see about the delivery. Well, thumped clear. Chilwell just cutting off the supply. Ducure. Coleman. It's with Ducure. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. He will be. On to Jorginho. And Goro Conte. Mount. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Goal for 
Oh, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Coming off the pitch, number seven, Ngolo Kante. Coming onto the pitch, number eight, Mateo Kovacic. Substitution for Everton. Coming off the pitch, number 17, Alex Iwobo. To be replaced by number six, Alan. Well, the free kick fired too close to the goalkeeper. Mateo Kovacic. Really good challenge. Calvert Lewin. Takes the shot. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Trying to deliver it accurately. The clearance wasn't decisive. McNeil. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Kovacic. Body on the line. And that was a very fine read. Calvert Lewin. Gordon. It's with Ducure. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. And time for the change now. Substitution for Everton. Coming off the pitch. Number 10, Anthony Gordon. To be replaced by number 20, Dali Ali. So here we are nearing the end of the contest. Can Chelsea turn a lead late into the game into an official victory? Stuart, how would you critique their performance in this one? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality. Certainly oh, wait a moment, Stuart. Look at what's happening. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Well, that save has just about kept them in it. But they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Determined defending. Free kick to Chelsea. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between them. This could be it! Can he finish? Oh, a smart save to keep the minute. Well, that keeps it interesting, but they're running out of time here. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And deciding to go short with this one. Calvert-Lewin. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Kukureya. Sterling has it. Kovacic. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. He's going forward well here. Gives it a go. Full time then, the referee's whistle, and it's a win for Chelsea. That's the big headline, Stuart. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end.
Well, the TV cameras get up close and personal with Raheem Sterling. Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.